I'll tell you what I don't like. Have you seen that fucking advertisement for Super Bowl 50? The 50s in gold. And for whatever reason, there's this woman standing there looking like the hot chick that walks in in some gumshoe movie from the fucking 1940s. She's standing there in a raincoat and high heels with like a golden umbrella. Telling you, it's it's over. It's fucking over. The Bills hired a... uh, I don't know what they hired. They had a woman for some job over. It's fucking over. It's done. It's done. Those three hours where you could get away as a married guy, you could just get away for three hours. It's it's, it's over. It's I, I it's going to sound like the Westminster Dog Show <laughs> in about seven years. You know, we had a great run. We had a great run, and now it's over. You know. But it's our own damn fault. It's our own damn fault. You know what it was? We just couldn't hide the joy we were having watching football without him. We couldn't hide the joy. And there's nothing that annoys a fucking woman like a bunch of guys going and having a good time without him. So they're in. They're dressing in pink for a fucking month. It's it's fucking it's fucking over. Uh I wish I just knew. I just knew. I wish I knew that it was going to come to this. I would have tried to enjoy, you know, my first 37, 38 years of football. They just flew by. I would have tried to enjoy them a little bit more. Now it's over. We should make a trade. This is what we should do. We should just trade him the WNBA. Just go like, what if we just give you a league? That we started. It'll be almost like a divorce where you just get it even though you didn't do anything. Or maybe you like emotionally supported the guy or some shit. Or whatever the fuck you say at the court, right? You just give them the WNBA. You can be the commissioners, all the owners, the commentators, the refs. You can be everybody in the stands. We'll give you your section of Buffalo Wild Wings. You know? Just, just don't take NFL football from us. Can you, can you just not? Just, can you give us? Can you just leave us with that? Can we just have that? Oh God. Maybe I'm just too old to understand it. Coach, can you tell us what happened there in the first half? Well, you know, we weren't getting it done, and uh, we got to get out there, maybe uh, try to have a little. You know, I'll tell you right now, nobody's having more fun than me. I just don't know if I'm ready for that. You know, I don't know. I just, you know, I don't, I don't know. Where, where do you go now? I guess, I guess the only place left is you, you, you become one of those weird old guys that plays chess in the park. <laughs> <laughs> you know what it is about chess? It's boring and quiet enough that they don't notice that you're over there without them enjoying yourself, you know? That's the genius. You ever see a guy who's been married for like 50 years, like the genius of him? I swear to God, the genius of him is they fucking, they know how to have a good time without their wife noticing. So it doesn't pique her interest, right? She's fucking over in the choir. She doesn't give a shit, right? But young guys, we're idiots. We come home with a big grin on our face talking about how awesome it was, and blah, blah. And all they hear is this motherfucker had the nerve to go out for three hours and not miss me and not think about me? Well, we'll see about that, won't we? Um, <laughs> it's fucking over. Oh, it's over, just like the Patriots season. So who do you guys like in the... Um, who do you guys like in the... Uh, I'm trying to think of an activity that women do. What, what fucking group that they have that I would like to infiltrate? And I, for the life of me, I can't think of it. You know? What do they got? The, the, the 4-H club? Girl scouting? Um, any of those feminist groups, they'd be a funny thing to join. Join one of those fucking groups and act like you're a feminist. You just go down there and you say, like the most ignorant but like, yet it's still pro women shit. Come down there with a fucking bud tall. Yeah, I just want to say, you know, I came down here to support you, broads. You know, I think it's, uh, I think it's fucked up the way the guy treats you. You know, just because you run around with a skirt and it takes you long to get ready doesn't mean you can't run the company, right? Am I right, ladies? Come on. 
uh, Bill, um, we really appreciate you coming down here. We think what you're saying is positive. We just, just some buzzwords here that we uh, put into a spreadsheet, a uh, little pamphlet thing that we'd like you to look at. Maybe you could not say them the next meeting. Maybe take a couple of weeks off. Oh, no, no, I'm showing up every week. Wait for him to kick me out. Then I sue him for being sexist. Um, no, I'm just a grumpy old man. That's all it is. I'm a grumpy old man who wants things to stay the same. You know, do I make any money off the NFL? I don't. I do have the mute button. You got you to gotta love the mute button. Anytime they cut to the chick on the sideline, I just fucking, I hit mute. You know, just trying to, to keep it going, you know, just for another couple more weeks. How come we can't blah, blah, blah? And then, okay, all right. Jesus Christ. I think it really comes, I don't know. What are you going to do? It's, you know, it's fucking over. It's our own goddamn faults. We just had too much fucking fun without them. So, you know, the next thing we start, <laughs> just you come home, you, 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 you tone it down. You fucking tone it down. You know, it'd be cool, though, if there was like a female like Vince Lombardi who came in. You know what I mean? And she had the exact same like, like demeanor. Grab, grab, grab. Nobody tackling out there. What the hell's going on? Today will be the greatest day of your life. Believe it. You know? They'll start having <laughs> They'll have their classic sayings. All right, everybody, grab a towel, cover your dicks. Let's <laughs> let's focus on next week. Today will be the best day of your life, but only if you win. Let's win one for the Gipper. <laughs>